Phuket, one of the most visited destinations in the world that attracts billions of tourists yearly because of its beautiful shores, wild nightlife, amazing tours and of course the tropical weather. But in order to enjoy all these things and have a wonderful vacation, you should know how expensive is Phuket and how much money you need to have a real holiday in this paradise. So in today's vlog I am going to share with you all the details that you should know from your daily expenses into tours, food, entertainments and much more. So sit back tight and enjoy the ride. Now in general Phuket is more expensive than any other destination in Thailand. But by following some tips you can save a lot of money and stay away from scams and unnecessary extra payments. The first expense that you need to know about are the tours. Cause visiting Phuket itself without doing any tour is not a complete holiday. So how much you should spend on the tours and where to get the best of them. The tours in Phuket Island are a lot and it's kind of impossible to do all of them by a short visit. I'm not going to talk about the tour details but the most famous ones are the islands and safari tours in the mainland. The prices ranges between 1000 to 2000 Thai baht for each trip which most of them are half day or full day trips. So usually you can do between 2 to 4 tours in a week and it won't cost you more than 5000 Thai baht in average. Now from where to book your tours it's so simple. Just walk around the main roads and you will see a lot of tour desks. Ask some of them the prices and get the best deal. And as I said it should be between 1000 to 2000 baht for a trip. So keep that in mind. Now let's talk about the food and restaurants. I'm sure you will be hungry while you are exploring this island. The weather and the mood will make you eat a lot. So how much to pay for a meal in Phuket? Usually there are lots of choices and here I want to say you could spend a lot if you eat in fancy restaurants and snacks. Yes, this is Thailand but as I said Phuket is the most expensive. So choose wisely if you want to save. In average a meal in Phuket will cost you between 300 to 500 Thai baht. And having 3 meals a day you might spend around 1000 Thai baht. Now there are street food choices in Phuket if you want to save but not as much as Bangkok. And if you are choosing the fancy places you might spend more than 1000 baht on a meal. After all you are in vacation so my advice to you check the prices and the choices before you sit and eat. The third expense that you might spend if you want to check the island are the transportation. Here I want to tell you be very wise because you can spend a lot if you choose the wrong type of transportations. The taxis and the tuk-tuks even the motorbikes are expensive in Phuket. A motorbike ride will cost you at least 100 Thai baht, a tuk-tuk ride not less than 200 Thai baht and a taxi ride not less than 400 Thai baht. For example a taxi ride from the airport to Patong city will cost you from 800 to 1200 Thai baht. So as you can see transportation is not cheap in Phuket unless you rent a motorbike and that way you will save a lot. Another expense will be the shopping. Now Phuket is not a shopping destination but you have some malls and markets that will attract you. If you are visiting Bangkok I don't recommend you to shop in Phuket but if not these are the prices and the tips. At the malls the prices are fixed like Junk Ceylon or Central Mall so no need to bargain. If you like something and you find the price reasonable then grab it. But at the markets and especially with the street markets and vendors the prices are high. 
and here you have to bargain. For example, a t-shirt that is priced for 500 Thai baht, you could have it for 300, yes, that much and sometimes more. Whereas the same t-shirt you can buy it from Bangkok without bargaining for 100 Thai baht. So that's the idea. Phuket is not a destination for shopping, but if you have no choice, then bargain. Now before we jump into another expense, let me tell you that things like sunscreen, creams, hats and sunglasses are expensive in Phuket. If you are buying of course original brands. So bring such stuff with you and you will save a lot. Unless you get them from Bangkok and take them with you to Phuket. Activities are a lot in Phuket, especially at the beach, and the scams too, so how much you should spend there while you are having fun. Most of the activities are overpriced, like jet ski ride, boat ride, and they will range between 800 to 1500, even sometimes more than that. So if you like to do some, get prepared to pay for it, but be careful not get scammed. So know the price, what you are paying for and enjoy your activity without extra expenses. Massage shops are all around Phuket, so no way to run. You might have some sessions while you are enjoying your vacation there but how much you should pay and what to avoid. In general, normal session will cost you between 200 to 500 Thai baht and the choices are a lot, so trying some will be fun, but staying away from scams will be wise too. So if you are looking for normal massage types, you won't pay more than that, but if you are looking for some other types, then you could pay from 800 to 3000 Thai baht depending on the service. All in all, having a foot massage in Phuket is a good idea and you should not pay more than 300 Thai baht. Here we come to the nightlife and the expenses of having fun at nighttime in Phuket. Now here I will divide it into two parts, the normal nightlife and the wild nightlife. Let us start from the normal ones. Phuket known for its nightlife, especially Patong and the most famous walking street Bangala Road. So wandering around, having some beers with some fun will not cost you more than 100 to 200 baht for a drink. And if you are enjoying some live music, then you might pay around 300 to 500 Thai baht for a cocktail. So as you can see, it's not expensive. Unless you are following some misleading guides and checking ping pong shows, then you might spend a lot for nothing. If you want to party hard and check the nightclubs, the bars, the gogo -go bars, have some company and even more, then you will spend a lot. Such nightlife in Phuket is not cheap. An average night could cost you between 3000 to 6000 baht. So it depends how much budget you want to spend on nightlife in Phuket. Because it could be costly, unless you like to have some beers and enjoy some music.
Now you might spend on other things in Phuket, but the ones I mentioned are the basic expenses. So what we conclude, first Phuket is not a cheap place for a vacation. So if you are planning a trip to Phuket and if you want to enjoy everything, you could spend daily between 2000 to 4000 Thai baht. And if you want to do more and go wild, then your budget could be more than 5000 baht a day. Saving in Phuket means doing nothing. It's not like Bangkok where you have lots of free activities. And yes, we can say Phuket is an expensive place for a vacation. So my friends, I hope you enjoyed this vlog and had an idea how expensive is Phuket these days and moreover how much budget you need for a good vacation there. After all, it all depends on you cause the choices are a lot. Thank you for watching, stay safe and subscribe for more from Live Love Thailand.